All right, it's it shouldn't be. It's broken still. This isn't good. Is it still broken? Let's see. Bro, what is happening? Hold on. Stream manager, unstable. Uh, uh. It's dead. All right, it says it's excellent now. I doubt it's going to continue being excellent. Let's see if I can, let's see. Okay, he says it's good now. Oh, by the way, uh, this guy's like, hey, d you should get a business line from Comcast. First of all, I don't, I refuse to give any more money to those fucking losers at Comcast. Um, Sam, is your dog Gwen named after the Souls boss? No, nah, her name's actually Guinevere, named after uh, the boss's daughter with the big titties. But my wife doesn't know that. <laughs> she doesn't know that her, she's named after a big titty, sexy lady. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty cool. Oh, and also that um, I think on our anniversary, we went to Bar Harbor, Maine, just because of that Fallout Bar Harbor uh, DLC. But yeah, I'm not going to give extra money to the stupid ass... I'm looking at the thing again. We're not gonna give me money to Comcast, dude. We have we have a new internet company coming to town, and I'm like waiting. I am just not only am I gonna uh, buy the new service from these people, but I'm gonna burn every bridge possible with Comcast. I'm gonna tell the service person to go fuck himself. I'm gonna do all sorts of shit. Yeah. <sighs> what type of mic cable? Uh, this, the red one or the green one? The red one is, uh, the red one's just an XLR cable. The green one is gaffer tape and it's holding a webcam. Yeah. Yeah, the red one, I don't know. It's just, hold on. It says a, what does that say? Speak friends, speak friends XLR. No, no, no. It's a, uh, um, it's just Metronet or something. It's, it's a uh, fiber. Yeah. It's, um, yeah, it's gonna be like optical, whatever. I should have gigabit internet with like good upload and stuff instead of whatever the spotty crap is that Comcast gives us. Oh yeah. Anyways, I'm supposed to be doing stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Anyways, we're on Woods, and you guys are going to be getting me that uh, that folder thing. So start listing off names here so I can start picking you guys up. Uh, 
Okay, Joe's okay, Joe's toes. You got it. Let's see here. Joe's toe. Wait. Oh, I just saw him a second. There he is. Okay, Joe's toes. Come on. No. What else we got here? Lots of crabs. Joe's toes, lots of D2 stair guard. He says that's his name. I don't see him. Oh, D2 stair guard one. Is that the guy? I'll get him. Scavs matter too. I like that. That one's <laughs> scavs matter too. Where's he at? Wait, touch my cob. I feel like that's a guy. Oh, scabs matter too. I did say his name first. Okay, these are all new people except for Joe's toes. I think these are all new people. And hold on a second. I have. I also have something else here. Um. Oh shit! Disconnected for inactivity. I was here for two seconds. I guess it starts at once you are looking at the thing. Okay, let's do the whole thing again. I'm. I'm sorry, guys. Fuck. All right, Scabs Matter 2 is definitely coming in here. Who are the other guys? Lots of crabs. Joe's toes. There's some other people. D2 stair guard. Isn't that everybody? I think that's everybody. Right? That was... That was Joe's toes invite me again. All right, hold on. Joe's toes decline my invitation. There we go. Come on, Joe's. Come on, toes. Okay, and then uh, scavs matter too. That guy is that is that our last dude? Okay. Now before we get kicked out again, I do have. Hold on. I got this here. Check this out. Check this out. I got our squad reviews. This way, in case something horrible happens, we can give these guys uh, reviews at the end to see how they did. If that's all right with you guys. D2 stair guard. And we'll give them a rating. Kind of like, I'm thinking this is kind of like, uh, like Yelp. <laughs> I was, I was, as I was saying, Yelp, I was typing it out. Lots of crabs. Uh, Joe's underscore toes. And of course, sca oops, scavs matter too. There we go. Oh, and then someone left. I don't know who that was. Wait, let's see. We got this guy, this guy, scavs matter, Joe's toes, lots of crabs. Are we missing someone? Am I insane? Here, I'm just gonna, uh, I don't know who the fuck just fell out, but I'm, I'm, I saw the, this bit, the baby nut. I think that's a guy that keeps going, like, invite me. Yeah, the baby nut TTV. Get in here. Yeah, someone just dropped out. Okay. I'll add him to the thing as well. So that's, uh, the baby nut. There we go. And then I can give these guys a glaring review after this. Oops. Hold on. Fuck. I am not good at using MS Paint, dude. This is this is hard. What's like the select tool? Oh fuck. Okay, hold on. I'm having problems here. Here we go. Perfect. I think that's fuck. Okay, I don't I don't know what I'm doing here. P MS Paint is not my strong suit. Sam, can you reduce delay for better comms? Bro, let me tell you something. You act like I'm... Uh-oh. I pulled up the thing again. 
you act like I this is as good as it gets This is the delay I got here Hold on, let me see what the Yeah, like I'm not putting up this delay intentionally It's supposed to be as quick as I can get it here He was kicked for inactivity. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, I don't I don't have like a what's the delay like anyways? I'm assuming um 10 seconds or so. 50 minutes. Oh, that's not good. Jesus. Probably 10 seconds or so. Yeah. Okay. That sounds about right. It doesn't matter. I, I'm going to let you guys lead the way and then I'll just, uh, I'll hang out and back. Mm -hmm. Maybe not in the back. I'll hang out in the middle. <laughs> oh, check this out, by the way, while we're loading in, cause we are, we are loading in. We see we're already, we're waiting for players and everything. Check this out. Okay. So I got some of this stuff almost finished. I got the, uh, I got my camcorder set up, uh, with mic over here, by the way, I got the mic. But I don't have any, no connection to it. So I got a uh, XLR uh, converter. It's like a phantom power thing. Uh, and then eventually, you know, I'll, of course that will be out of the way and I can lower the, I'll have the green screen lowered and all that jazz. And then it'll just be like green screen thing. I should be able to like present uh, or do bits and stuff like midstream. Um, it's all coming together, baby. It's all coming together. I figured out how to do this stuff. <clears throat> and then uh, I'm also, I think I'm gonna get a GoPro too to take the place of, of this right here. Or maybe another, I think the GoPro might be the way to go for having on. Wait, can't I, can that zoom out more? Oh uh, yeah, but then the the green screen will be clipping on the left and right. Needs to be, I guess, zoomed in so the edges reach. There you go. I guess that's why I did that. Who the fuck knows why I do anything, man? My life is a history's mysteries. When are you gonna stop testing? Uh, I think, I think Wednesday is is when my stuff gets in here and i should be able to i was i was gonna wait to do this stuff for like my main stream when uh when i get the new internet but who knows how fucking long that'll take and i kind of like these little 50 person streams you know i'm able to sit there and and fully talk about stuff. Блять, своих хвалит крыса бразотная. Never mind, I gotta stay focused. На месте. There we go. Stop. Как насчет объединиться? All right, guys. Oh, Ready to go. Turn down this shit. God, this, this game's so loud. Дикий минус. Дикий минус. Братишка, давай hey, вместе. Stay clear. Okay. Let's uh, on delay, man. Let's go. Hey, let's let's. Party. Hey, what's up, everybody? Remember, all your career reviews will come in after this. So I hope when you're out in the field, you present yourself with uh, honor and integrity. And you prove to me that you guys are, are worth bringing in a second time. <laughs> all right, wait, let me get a good look at you. One of you guys has a beard. We should make like a standard outfit that we all wear and then we bring in different guns or like a standard backpack or something. We got a fucking I like rat. the pee helmet. I, I'm just pee helmet's Stay the way at. to go. I got one too, right? Yeah. Okay. All right, let's go. We got to hey, go to the, the lumber mill and get some shit. Do a standard armband. Yeah, we should do an armband, but I can, I never end up seeing those. Hold on a second. What is this? Can you get up on this and snipe from it? Ooh. La la. That's a little, that's a little may may maybe. Hmm? That's pretty cool. I've never, I've never really played woods all that much. I'm going to be honest. 
Oh, you just finished Tenet? Is it any good? I mean, it's gonna win awards because like no other fucking movie came out this year, but is it is it actually something that is worthy of winning awards because I, I love christopher nolan get, get but i feel the... like he makes ah! oh shit okay come on jesus <laughs> that sucks <laughs> See, this is why I said I wanted to be, I wanted to be the fucking middle. You know, I didn't want to be the guy in the front. I didn't want to be the guy in the back. I wanted to be the guy in the middle. Yeah, this is definitely on. Oh, this is definitely going to negatively impact uh, our ratings here. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and say, let me die. <laughs> Zero out of 10. Can I just like, oh, can I just copy and paste that over and over and over again? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes. Well, that's our first set of reviews coming in. <laughs> Pretty lackluster. Pretty lackluster. <laughs> I have your gun and dog tag. All right. Now the, uh, okay, so I got railed by some guy, John Michael. Head ear. Got me right in the fucking ear. Wait, what'd he hit me with? M62. And that fucking P helmet didn't help at all, did it? Jesus. Yeah, what I was saying about that uh, Christopher Nolan stuff, dude, that guy, I feel like, makes movies that are extremely convoluted for the sake of them being extremely convoluted. You know what I mean? Like, it's it's not necessary. Uh, like, was Interstellar, could it have been just a, an effect, as effective of a movie if it wasn't so fucking annoyingly heady? You know what I mean? It's a really cerebral experience. I thought it was a great movie. I liked it better than uh, Inception. People act like Inception was like, yeah, you know I mean, people you see and they're like, I couldn't fucking like wrap my head around Inception. It was just a fucking dream inside of a dream. Dude, come on. It wasn't that hard. It wasn't that difficult. And they act like it was uh, uh, the toughest movie ever to watch. Sam, I killed him, but Joe's toes TK'd me. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Fuck you, Joe. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, guys. Hold on. Joe's toes, he says. Joe's toes. Possible. tk -er. Hmm. I'll remember that. <laughs> Lots of crabs wasn't even there. I was, uh, yeah, you were, you were fucking replaced by somebody. So I don't know, uh, but right now that guy is you because I forget who it was. Yeah. Uh, no, no, don't bring me a kit. Just bring your body and gear you're willing to lose. And uh, I'm, I'm gearing back up. I'm getting ready to go back out. Hold on. I'll bring a backpack. Put all this shit back. Bring this. Should I even bring a helmet? Like, you know, I'll bring this stupid one. And this mustache this time. Mustache is imperative. I'm going to bring a shotgun. I'm going to be the CQC guy on the team. That's going to be my claim to fame. All right, let me see some names. We're going back out to woods. We're going to go to that stupid place and we're going to do the stupid folder thing. Okay. I see lots of crabs and you said you, you were swindled. You weren't actually a guy that was there. 
Miss Me Melot. On, oh, I saw Melot a second ago. Melot. No, did I not see Melot? I know Mr. Salient's in here. Well, let's see who else we got. I'm not using hacks. I feel like the guy named I'm not using hacks is probably using hacks. I don't know if I want him in there. The baby nut. Hmm. I will. I He was in there last time, but. Is in, oh, yeah. Milo is down here on. Okay. That's Mr. Salient. Whole, I gotta I gotta catalog these. We got a new one, Mr. Salient. Okay. Lots of crabs. The baby nut and Milot. I don't like that name, Milot. A strange name. Okay, so right now we have um on. I should have a button set up to turn this stupid thing on and off. All right, actually, I don't even know why I have this on here th this way because, wait, lots of crabs. Is there a way to erase that? No, I'm not gonna erase. I'm gonna do uh, one better. I'm gonna strike through it like this. Because that was a false accusation. Lots of crabs never actually let me die. He wasn't in the in the last one. He's getting a redux here. A redo. And then these people are moving back up here. Oh, the baby nut was also... Shit. He did let me die last time. Because <laughs> he was in there. There we go. But I'll move this guy up. I'm pretty sure this is not how you're supposed to organize things. But this is how I'm doing it. So that's fine. <laughs> Alright. There we go. Use a public shared Word document so we can put our scores in. Dude, that is... That is a little bit above and beyond my pay grade. I don't know how to do that shit. If you guys actually, that's a good idea. I should spend this extra time I have uh, that I'm, I'm going to use setting up this stuff uh, for figuring out how to do like, yeah, like shared documents and crap. Or maybe some scoring card thing that's like interactive with chat. I know there's a lot of stuff like that you can do. Now, if I put it on Google Docs, everybody's got to just, like, delete everything and then save it. Sending Herman Miller lounge chair of mine to you. Okay, first of all, I doubt you have one. Secondly, <laughs> you don't have to send me one. Because the, uh, the lounge chair is kind of my white whale. It's the thing that I'm, I'm, this is why I, I get up in the morning. The lounge chair is the reason, you know, it's like it, it's, uh, the lounge chair is my Batman and I'm the Joker. I don't want to kill it. I don't want to have it. I don't want to purchase it. Cause then what would I do? Why would I get up? Why would I edit? Why would I upload? Do you think I do this for the love of the craft? No, I do it because one day I might be able to sit down on a beautiful Herman Miller Eames lounge chair with a palisander shell and black leather cushions. One day. But if I had it, yeah, I would probably just retire and then just sit in it and do nothing. That's my end game. Sit in it and read uh, Country Living magazines. <laughs> That's what I'm going to do for the rest of my life. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. A black leather walnut and matching standing desk. Dude, I'm not going to lie. 
the uh you know if you go and customize those things on the website i used to be a walnut guy because that's a very classic look it's like an ashy wood look but the uh, palace sanders just got such uh oomph to it you know there's a lot of contrast going on there with the uh with the shells i don't know it's a toss-up but i can tell you one thing if and when i get that fucking chair every podcast from here on out will be recorded in that chair It'll ju- you'll just get an angle of me just fucking laying back. <laughs> I'll just, this is what you'll see. Just me fucking sitting there with my arms dangling by my side. <laughs> and dude, if they, when they, when they legalize, uh, you know, the, the smonk juice, when they legalize the devil's lettuce, you can bet your ass I'll be sitting in one of those things fucking smoking every podcast. That's the only way I'd be able to, I think, endure Brian and Poob for any length of time. By the way, we got three seconds till we're loading in. I'm going to... No, I won't sleep in the Herman Miller lounge chair. Maybe if, if me and my wife have a fight or something. All right. You guys, this time, lead... To the fu- go to the fucking lumber mill. Oh, this guy's got the silence DVL. That's the look right there. Is this the direction? Yeah, you guys lead the way. I have no idea where the hell I'm going. Do they have medicinal down it? Yeah, they do, but I don't. I don't have like the 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 degree. You know, whatever, the green card. Don't shoot that guy. He's one of us. He's one of us. Yeah, we're kind of split up. A little bit. No, they have it, but they, uh, you have to have a, you know, I have to go to my doctor and lie to him and say I got glaucoma or something, and then he'll give it to me. But my doctor's a pretty fucking laissez-faire, uh, doctor, man. He, he's really... You guys know that Louis C.K. bit where he's talking about his ankle being fucked up and the doctor's like, yeah, your ankle's just fucking broke now. <laughs> I guess you just, you, you and your shitty ankle are just, yeah, it's like that. It's my, like if I go to my doctor and I'm just like, dude, I have a hernia in my fucking, this is what he told me. I got, I had a hernia, right? From playing Cards Against Humanity. My belly button hurts. And he goes, when does it hurt? I go, if I like poke it or something, or if I pick up something heavy and he's like, okay, well then don't do that. <laughs> I'm like, well, what about like fixing it with like surgery? He's like, we could do that. Do you want to do that? I guess, I guess we can do that. I'm like, what do you recommend? You're the medical professional. He's like, I recommend you don't touch it or pick up heavy things. I'm like, that's the fucking laziest doctor way I've ever heard in my life. What the fuck? Yeah. If you say you have chronic back pain. Oh shit. Yeah, I do have that. I herniated a disc in my back and like ever since then I've been having pretty bad uh, back problems and apparently it helps with the the inflammation or whatever, right? Which is totally what I'd use it for. Totally just for inflammation. Alright guys. We need to get in there and grab some sort of secure folder. Um, I, I don't know. Should we wait until... And do you guys want to move in like SEAL Team 6 and, and grab the folder or should we wait a little bit? This guy says he hears, he hears Sturman. That's not good. Uh-oh. We're getting shot at. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Yeah, and there's grenades going off and everything. There's some mean shit here. Yeah, I'm just gonna... There we go. There we go. Okay. Now, let me tell you something. I want you guys to clear out the lumber mill. And I want you to do it right now. <laughs> That's what I want. <laughs> So get in there. (laughs) I don't like this angle at all. What's wrong with this? (laughs) What's wrong with this angle? (laughs) How how will you know if they die or not? I'll know because I'll keep an eye on them with my eyeballs. 
I'm moving behind them. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be. I'm not gonna like. Oh. Did you just get someone? Oh, we're getting shot at. From Quince. I'm backing up a little bit. I'm gonna go down here. All right, we should do this one step at a time. We should invade this big lumber building uh, up yonder. I know I got a friend to my left. Yeah, BBL guys to my left. I got three friends to my right. We got to get inside this, the main lumber bu building here. That's, that's going to be our... Oh, Lord. Oh, no. I'm hurt. Oh, my fucking leg. Run interference. Zig and zag, people. Zig and zag, serpentine. Something. Just throw, a, throw a smoke shield or something. Holy shit. Who hit me? Oh, more bullets. I'm going. I got to go in here. Oh, it hurts. Oh, no. Oh, fuck. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Why am I the only person that gets fucking legged? Why am I the only person that gets legged? This is, this is not okay. Why am I bad? Why, why am I bad? I should be, I got killed by fucking Belle Delphine probably because of what I said about our last video. It's not my fault. She sucks at doing, you know, the one act of pleasure that every woman should practice and know how to do. It's not my fault. Her job is looking good. You would think that she would know how to suck a penis. Okay, so all I'm saying is <laughs> all I'm saying is I should be able to be a paraplegic. If I have four friends that are in a game, they should be able to carry me into the into the place and get the I sh you know what I should have done? I know exactly what I'm going to do next time. I'm going to get to a position outside the lumber camp and I'm going to say, and I'm going to get a person. I'm going to say, uh, uh, lots of crabs. You run in there and you get that folder. You have four minutes and then we'll wait for him to return. Oh wait, he can't grab it for me. Fuck. Hmm. How can we do this? Hmm. Okay, we'll send him in as a as a scout, and then if he says it's all clear and makes it back in in two minutes, then we go in as a full force. I think that's how we do it. Yeah. And then yeah, we'll move in, much like a, a phalanx does in in like the Roman military. Where you guys will be in a giant circle around me, and uh, and then I'll 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 be in the middle wearing ivory armor, and uh, I'll have a, <laughs> and then I'll fight uh, Russell Crowe in the middle. No, it's, uh, <laughs> it's like the end of fucking Gladiator. But like, yeah, if you guys could bring in some tower shields or something, that would be great. All right. I think I'm gonna, uh, here, I just got random crap to bring in. Should I actually bring in something where I'm like, I can fight? I guess I, I should. What's a good, like, middling... I can kind of do something weapon. SA-58s are all around good, right? That's kind of a, um, I can do things type gun. Here we go. I'll bring this. I'll take this stupid thing off of there. I want to put that on. Wait, can I put that on there? Like that? No? Oh, that's only for Remingtons. Life's fucking hard, man. Okay. I got it. And I, we also have to set up a, a, a uniform. I forgot about that whole thing. Okay, so I have this. Do I have any more of these? I think I have a... I don't have a drum mag or something. No, I'll bring that out on later. Yeah, that works. Technically. Um, get the rounds from it. 
You know what? Fuck it. I, I'll just bring this. M80s are still viable, right? That's still a good round or something, maybe. No? I got M62s. Those are probably even better. Is there any more M80s in here? Am I stupid? There we go, there's some. I think that's all of them. Okay. I'll bring out two of these mags and then unload everything from this one and then get rid of this fucking stupid thing. Get in there. What's in this one? More M80s? Yeah. And then I'll, I'll put M62s in my little pocket here so I don't lose them in the middle of a fight. All right, so the official the official outfit here is uh, definitely going to be a white armband. So people are think ooh, people think we're surrendering. I want to see a regular balaclava, a pair of snow goggles, and a green pea helmet on every single person that I bring in. That should be the standard. You can wear whatever armor or whatever you want, but like that, I should be able to see like P helmet, gray, green goggles, white armband, and be like, that's my boy right there. That essay with the barrel end is going to blow your ears off. Good. I hope it fucking, you know what? I hope that makes my enemies quake when I shoot. I hope to just blow their asshole out just by the sound because I know I'm not going to hit them. Let's do it. Wait, I do have everything I need, right? I think that's everything. Woods, third time's the charm. 6 a.m. You guys are bleeding me dry here. Okay, let me see here. First of all, if I go back to the uh, this thing. Microsoft Paint here. I can tell you right now that hey what, what do we got here uh, let me get shot and leg killed nobody zero out of ten which uh also happened with meatloaf And also happened with lots of crabs. And I think that's it, right? Isn't that everybody? I took a bullet standing over you. Who is that? Mr. Salience? Okay, he took a bullet standing over me. Okay, I might have to I might have to, to redo some stuff here. Hold on. He took a bullet, guys. He said he took a bullet. One out of ten. <laughs> you get one out of ten. <laughs> but everybody else is still on my shit list. Okay, and what we're going to do here... That was actually... That's two squads combined, but I'm going to make... My next squad's going to be down here. I'm going to do... I'm, I should split it up. All right. What do we got here? Uh, who wants to... I'm not using hacks. I'll trust him for not using hacks. I'll bring him in. Wait, actually, hold on. Hold on. I'm sorry. I don't want to get kicked for AFK or whatever. So, cause that's what happened last time I started fucking around with paint. I'll bring him back in D2 stair guard. Hold on. He let me die the first time. Wait, let's get some new people in here. Shrapnel 10. That's, that's my man right there. Scavs matter. I don't know. He let me die last time. Who else we got? Uh, Mr. Salient. Shamrock 11. D2 stair guard. I think he was in the first one. So I'll bring, I'll bring him in this time. Is that four or five? 
Custom Slurper. Come on. There we go. Oh my god, he is beefed up. He's not, he didn't bring the P helmet. Dude, dude. You can't be breaking the rules of the outfit. You got to wear the P helmet. That's part of it. You know what? If you're not going to agree with dress rehearsal, that's part of dress rehearsal. Next time, Mr. Salient's being subbed in. You got to wear the best of the best in this outfit. I'm not going to take some... This guy's not even... <laughs> what the fuck are you wearing, Mr. Salient? Get out of here. You got to wear... All right, what else? Scavs matter. Let's see if he can not fuck this up. There we go. That's what I like to see. That's a man that knows knows what to wear. He's, yeah, these guys are a bunch of fucking phonies. <laughs> Jesus. Now I, I, I want to be able to see it just by sight. I fucking didn't even, I didn't even remember who I got in. So I can't, I can't even write down the names of the people. Yeah, I don't, I don't remember their, uh, their names, man. Who, who was that? What people did I have in there? I had Mr. Uh, no, I didn't have Mr. Salient, did I? Yo, Sam, what's the weather like in Florida? Dude, honestly, it's been pretty rainy and pretty shitty. But uh, today it's kind of cold, which is nice. Um, I think it's like in the 50s, and it should be in the 50s for the rest of the week. Which is pretty cool. You know, I'm pretty up there. I'm going to do a little test thing, make sure everything's still running. Hey, that's still running. still running right yeah okay let me sure everything's working i'm gonna get a coke real quick wait a second <laughs> hey look at the look at the look at the pink floyd album art <laughs> uh, there's so many. I have so many stupid ass like little board things to mess with now. Pink Floyd is shit. You know, I'd be inclined to agree with you. Uh, not agree with you. They're not my favorite band by any means, but that's like. An original pressing, not original, maybe not an original pressing, probably mid seventies pressing of dark side of the moon and my, it was my dad's and it has like all the posters and everything still in it. So I was like, eh, fuck it. It, it already had the frame. He had bought the frame for it. Yeah. You know, is there a donation thing? Nah, man. And I know you guys probably don't like seeing like these phony records and stuff. So don't worry. I do still have the most legit record out there. I just haven't hung it up yet. But don't worry. When, when I get around to hanging stuff up, I'll put back Marty Robbins gunfighter ballads and trail songs. It'll be back on the wall. I can assure you. It'll, it's, it'll come back soon. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, the, uh, oh, this guy's like, <laughs> Mr. Salian's pissed off. He's like, I was wearing thermals. I'm sorry. <laughs> You weren't wearing thermals. You were wearing night vision. I saw you. You were in the splinter cell ones, the master Yi ones. 
Sam, what does that poster say? The the enlist from? Oh, where is it from? What is the? I have no idea. Some guy sent back when I had a PO box, and I had just moved into my rental. Right, I was in a rental place. My walls were bare because all we had was two crackhead couches and some like silverware that was hand me down, and my walls were bare. And some guy sent into the PO box a um. He sent in that that poster. It says like "Welcome to the League of Extraordinary Bastards" or some shit. What does it say? Hold on. Enlist in the League of Magnificent Bastards. And uh, I was like, "All right, sweet." I finally got wall art, and I put it up. And Abby's like, "What is this?" But I just kept it because I, you know, it's cool. It's cool. All right, guys, lead the way. Wherever wherever we're going. Wait, you get you guys have to lead, dude. I don't know where the hell I'm going. Is this is this the right way? No, that's not the right way. Where the fuck are we? Oh wait, hold on. Everybody come greet me. Everybody come greet me. Should say the greeting button. Hey bro. Okay, no, that, you guys are flicking me off. You're not greeting me. There we go. I'm not using hacks. I'm not using hacks. Uh, Shamrock 11. Who's the other guy? Oh, D2 stair guard. Scavs matter. Okay. I gotta, I gotta get down my squad before the, the, the game, dude. That way I know what I'm judging at the end of this. All right, I do kind of know where we are, but I really don't want to lead, because uh, this, if I remember correctly, we're just out in the middle of fucking nowhere. Oh, okay. You guys are leading. Finally, let's do it. <clears throat> Zero out of ten across the board incoming. Why? Right, come on. You don't think you don't have faith in these guys? Every new raid that we go into, I get a, a better and better feeling. Most people get demoralized as they receive more and more failures, but I know that eventually once i get the failures out of the way the only thing left is success you can't just exclusively fail for your entire life eventually you're gonna fall and trip your way into a big w nice. i don't know how long it takes but is it Oh, there's another one. I'm gonna get down while you guys handle that. This guy was killed, right? Whoop. He's just bleeding? He's not dead? Oh, there he is. There he is. Yeah, this guy had an ADAR if you guys are interested. I'm just gonna take the backpack. Yeah, ADAR and cigarettes. Huh? You guys like cigarettes? Apple juice. Nice. All right, guys, if you guys need any hydration, I'm your hydrator. You let me know. I, Daddy Sam will provide any and all beverages for this play date. You guys just have to provide the muscle. Ooh, BT. Isn't there like a... Did somebody go down here? Is there somebody down there? Oh, oh that's a friend. It's a friend. Okay. <laughs> hey, give me the spookies. 
Yeah, I'm, I'm bringing the orange slices and graham crackers. Yeah, this is, we're having a blast down here. I'm not going to lie. Great time, but we're really, really far away from, from the place we're supposed to be. Stop. Oh, more vodka. All right, guys, I got apple juice and vodka. Anybody want a mixed drink? You let me know. We still got some time, though, until we're going to need beverages. Bethesda needs to get their shit together and release Elder Scrolls 6. You know what, dude? I'm, at this point, I just... I don't even fucking care what they make. They, are, they have just dropped the booth so hard that I don't even want them to pick it up. Is this one of us? That should be our this should be our our team helmet the tank helmet That's that should definitely be the team helmet because nobody wears those fucking things All right, let's head on out of here All right, we're going to the the lumber mill, right? Does anybody know how to get to the lumber mill? Are we going the right way? This guy, this, okay, guy, the 3M guy with the white shirt and the Ikea vest, he's the leader. We let him run easily first uh, 10 feet, 20 feet ahead. Lead us to the lumber mill. Yeah, I think, uh, I think I need to come up with a new, a new disguise for us. Uh, I'm thinking tank helmet. Balaclava, circle shades. What do you guys think? Can't rock the tank helmet. And nobody should be able to hear. At least that way we're not wasting money on hearing aid, hearing aid things. Whatever they're called. Headphones. Man, they just left us. Zamri, stop. Is this guy leading us into a minefield? I feel like this is a minefield. Are you going into a minefield, dude? Or is that, was that a mine? Oh! I, I knew this was a minefield. Oh my god, you're all getting hit by <laughs> Oh <laughs> Are you alright? <laughs> they keep hitting them. There's another one. I'm scared to move. I'm just <laughs> Are you guys okay? <laughs> oh my god. Is it? This guy took this way up, so I'm. Oh, holy shit! Okay. Oh no, I thought it was gonna be clear over here because he already took this way. Fuck. All it did was shatter my leg, though. Not that bad. It's like tremors. They can't put them on the rocks, can they? Jesus. <laughs> Oh, but I thought that I thought he had cleared this way already. Does anybody have a leg thing to like help the break? Have I got an alu splint? Oh, you beautiful bitch! Who's that? Who just gave me this? Yo, uh, hey, can you? I want you to. Can you say like hi to me or whatever? What is it? We greet me. Greet me, but I'm not using hacks. Greet me. Okay, hold on. This guy's got a... This guy's getting points here. Gave me splint. Very big deal. That's a big deal right there. Very important. All right, right now, it, this is this is positively affecting your Yelp review. I'm not going to lie. This is, you're, you're doing great, great right now. All right. No one's left behind? Yeah. He spawned me in a one-use splint, dude. This guy is using hacks. Incredible. 
Uh, yeah, just stay on the rocks and you can't blow up. That's the rules. Dicky needles. Did you guys loot all this in here? Hell no, you didn't. There's goodies in here, man. Goodies. I thought the uh, the explosives would do a whole lot more damage, like a mine. Because, you know, you see all those pictures of, like, elephants and stuff that have ran into a, a mine and their legs all blown off. And, um, I'm not, you know, I'm not saying I'm, I'm buff or anything, but I am saying that my leg is, I would think, not as substantial as an elephant's leg. And I'm perfectly fine. All it took was one, a piece of aluminum and a wrap up of a little IFAC. Let's go. Let's do it, man. Mr. 3M Armor, you have served us valiantly. You blew up two legs, maybe three legs. If you don't want to pull the Vanguard anymore, uh, we can cycle you out for the guy with the ADAR on his back. But you know what? He seems content with leading the way, so I'll, I'll just go ahead and let him do it. This feels like a place where there wouldn't be mines. So I'm feeling a little bit safer here. Hmm. 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 You know, the more I hear that Dicky Needles line, I've realized that it isn't at all Dicky Needles. It's Dick Eminos or something. Dicky Ninos, Dicky Ninos. What is it? It's not Dicky Needles. I thought there was definitely a D in there last time. Yeah. Okay. So that I was meaning to ask you guys about that. The Jaeger fuel situation, like because Bitcoin is ridiculous because Tesla bought like $1.9 billion in Bitcoin. It's officially ruined the value of Bitcoin. So it's so expensive now that Elon Musk is actually personally affecting my Tarkov experience <laughs> because now fuel is worth a, a gorillion dollars because people want to mine Bitcoin. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, everybody over here. Let's get down into this little, uh, this little pit. Hold on, right here. This is our pit, our command pit. Okay. All right, first things first. Oh my God. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh no. <laughs> what? Where? Where? Ow, fuck. Is he up there? <laughs> yeah, he's up there. Fuck. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, I'm fucking dead. He was up on the rock. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Dude, I can't strategize if I'm getting shot at. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> what victim? Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, okay. Sham, Sham, what was it? Shamrock 11. He was the first one to die there. That was hard to watch. That was hard. Jesus. That was uh that was pretty demoralizing. Uh Shamrock he uh took a bullet. Died heroically. Wait, is that how you spell heroically? He hero ically. Heroically, right? Isn't that a word? No? Yes. Yeah, that's heroically. Okay. Died heroically. He's definitely getting a pretty high rating. D2 Stairguard. 
He was uh he was our vanguard. Disarmed three. Count them three mines. A true hero. He gets a high rating as well. Scavs matter. Did he do anything? What did he do? What scavs matter do? You know what? I'm laying this all on scavs matters. Uh, he fa he failed to get me <laughs> the secure container. <laughs> Zero out of ten. I'm just gonna lay blame on him. That way, I don't have any blame. Saved my life. This is uh, this is I'm not using hacks. He gave me the splint. He saved my life. He's getting the highest rating possible. Now that that was a pretty good run until the end there. The end is really what made the whole thing fall apart. Um That's that's uh that's the woods raid. I really should have a better system for this. This looks like dog shit. Okay, maybe we should move on to a different map. Cause I don't know about you guys, but that map fucking sucks. That's not their not their best effort map wise. Either that, or it might be kind of a solo adventure where I'm not talking as much and I can just concentrate on getting in and out. Labs or customs? Let's see if I I think customs might be the play here. I do have a I do have some custom shit to do. Tarkov is really blowing this wipe. Dude, let me tell you something. That's not my, that's not what I'm saying, but Prodigy said that. Let me tell you something. Um, Tarkov, I would love to be into this wipe as hard as I was last wipe. But first of all, I had the kid like as soon as it wiped. So I haven't been able to play. Everybody's light years beyond me. And then that's just like got me so demoralized. I don't even feel like playing, to be honest. Like, I'm not engaged into it like I was. But I will always love this game. Because it's fucking ridiculous. There's, there's nothing else. I could see getting tired of this game and going and playing something else. But nothing out there. I don't think anybody can argue this. Nothing out there scratches the itch that this game scratches when you want that itch scratched. You get what I'm saying here? You guys understanding what I'm saying here? <laughs> it's, uh, isn't it like a, I don't think I've ever played a game where I'm like, dude, this, it's very niche. Yeah, it's very niche. It's a good game though. Great game. There was a time before they did all the excess loot and before they had all the, uh, uh, the hideout and all that crap. I thought. Tarkov and Hunt Showdown were kind of similar in their in their level of intensity. Uh. But once they added all the the scrap crap you can have, all the um the hideout and the missions and the quests and everything, they're nothing alike. This game is is so much beyond Hunt Showdown. I should duo with Aqua. <sighs> Boys, you know, I thought you wanted to have an entertaining stream. I thought this was why we were here. <laughs> no, I, uh, no, I, I just, uh, this, this is a private stream for us, us boys. This is a boy stream. Yeah. Yeah. Not on the secure account. This is, <laughs> this is a secure account only stream. This is for the, the real bros. Okay, so hold on. Let, let's let's start strategizing for next run here. Okay, I think I might just tell the therapist to fuck off and die because I'm going to be honest with you guys. I think Woods is beyond our skill level. Uh, Gather stuff. At, oh, wait, hold on. I should do this by map, shouldn't I? You go to like character... And then you go to tasks and then you can see the map. 
Like, I don't want to go to woods. Let's see. Customs. Kill 25 scavs on customs. Chemical, part two. Find any evidence that could help the investigation. Do you, wa you want me to, do you guys want me to read the thing so I can figure out what this is? We got tired of waiting already. Documents that you got from the din of this humanoid weigh quite a bit. Pretty heavy they are, but this is damn dangerous cargo. And there is no clarity. Who will be the best buyer for it? And it's not even so much about the profit as it is about getting some enormous freaking problems if we choose the wrong addressee. So here's the key that you found out there as well. Try to dig up further. My guy said it's from a dorm room. And judging from the documents, our deputy chief was seen on the second floor of the first building. Any info you could find in this room can come in very handy and the prize will be impressive. All right. We're going to dorms, baby. Customs, dorms. Doesn't seem like that's too hard. By the way, whoever translated this to English did not do a good job. That does not read like anybody would ever speak. Who calls someone a humanoid? Yeah. Um, let's see here. I'm going to look up chemical part two because I don't know like the stuff I need for this. Okay, chemical part two. <laughs> chemical part two. Escape from Tarkov. Wiki. It's from Skiers. It's a pickup quest. It's required for Kappa. I'm not, I'm not getting that thing. Um, any evidence you could help with the thing, with the thing, and then the thing, and the thing. Rewards. Skier will like me more. 15,000 rubles. He'll slap me on the ass. Um, and he'll give me three F1 hand grenades. And I'll be able to buy SAIO2 round magazines. I don't know what that is. Whatever. <clears throat> what we'll need related quest items. Sealed letter from Terror Group. A secure flash drive. And I need a dorm room 220 key. That's what I need. Thank you. Dorm room 220. Do I have that on me? No. Do I have that in here? Dorm room. Room 220. Okay, I'll buy it. Dorm room 220. $18,000. Fuck. I guess people are still doing this quest. I don't need these markers anymore, I don't think. Okay. Bring an IFAC. You know what? Just because I came in so much handy last time, I'm going to bring all the actual med stuff I'll ever need. Then... All right, this is going to be our... Are you guys paying attention? You guys paying... Sam, how did you get 9 mil? Oh, from selling Bitcoin. I have the, the Bitcoin farmer thing. You know what I'm talking about. You guys should have it too, right? Every once in a while, like... How do you sell it? You just fucking give it to therapists. They sell for like 600,000. <laughs> yeah. Uh, now, I don't have any fuel. I should get some fucking fuel for sure. Hold on. I'm going to look, look at this. Look at fuel prices right now. I blame this 100% on Elon Musk. Look at this. $670,000 for a fucking fuel tank. It's already gone. I'm gonna buy three of them. I was thinking about doing uh, runs where we would do nothing but go to reserve and get fuel tanks from all the spawn locations. But then I realized that... Um, I fucking, that's not a good team, team building exercise type thing. All right. So if we're going to customs, I forgot. We need to, we need to look here. Uh, can you buy a tank helmet from Ragman? Can you buy it from Ragman? Does he sell the glorious tank helmet? He does not. Okay. This is going to be. So 
Could be your shit right here. What? There we go. Tank crew helmet. That's what it's called. Oh my god, they're cheap as hell. Hell yeah, this is our outfit. Our outfit's all about economic efficiency. Buy four or five of these. Okay. Uh, and then you gotta have. Boom, this. And I think circle shades are pretty expensive, dude. We might have to back down and just do, you know, something like maybe these, the dun dunducks. Might have to do dunducks. Let's see how that looks. Oh my God. Oh my God. Yeah, okay, okay. I'm gonna cut you guys some slack. Tank helmet, balaclava, whatever shades you wanna wear whatever shades okay if you guys want to i'm just saying if you're an aristocrat and you got some extra if you want to show that you got some dosh you can go with circle shades that's a little bit too uh my blood's not thick enough for that you know i don't have the resources for that but if you guys want to if you want to flex on some hoes feel free but that's a look right there now i'm just going to say in front of everybody I did not invent this look. This is Bizzle Snaff's look. He is the he's the guy that always wears a tank helmet. He always wears balaclava. But the reason why I'm adopting it for this scenario is because this is the most identifiable thing that a person can wear. Look at it. I look like a fucking Teletubby. No way is any friendly fire gonna happen. Cause I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you guys, we are about to be in the nitty gritty. We're about to be in the trenches taking grenades. We're going to be in the middle of the dorm room. Our elbows are going to be busting up against that that flaking lead paint on the walls. We're going to be freaking out about getting uh, cancer and mesothelioma from all the <laughs> asbestos insulation and tile in there. And all that combined with the fact that there's angry Russians and they're shooting at us. It's going to be very important that we keep our heads on a swivel and be able to see who's friend and who's foe just by eyesight and so when i turn and see this dipshit looking back at me with a tank helmet and some circle shades i don't know that's a friend it's very important oh and yeah get a white armband if you can I, that's not even gonna matter as long as you got the tank helmet you'll be all right all right we're going customs i do need to kill some scavs so i'm gonna bring an ak or something that's a good scav killing ak I should probably legitimately just... I'm just going to bring a legit AK in. Because I'm tired of fucking around and dying. Two seconds in. Yeah, I'll bring this in. And I thought I had some mags prepped, but I guess not. Bring some Karund armor. That's good stuff. And a Triton rig. Wait, that's 5.56. Five, there we go. Yeah, I don't think I have any other mags. Crap war. Buy three from him. Okay. Alright, guys. I think that's a good look. I think it's a good look. I'm also going to come in with, uh, I guess I'll bring a backpack too. Come on. Yeah. Wait, do I need food? I think, hold on, I'm just going to take one little sip. One tiny little sip. There we go. All right, boys. Customs. 1035. Start spouting off names. I want to see names. What do we got here? Sham Wait, Shamrock11. Let me look at his Yelp review. He took a bullet from me last time. He's coming back in. Wait, Joe's Toes. Let me look at his Yelp review. 
Ooh, Joe's toes. Possible TKer. He literally he let me die in the first round. <sighs> redemption arc. Come on. Joe's toes redemption arc. Anybody? He says it was an accident. I wiggled Joe. He wiggled at Joe and he still shot him. All right, wait, hold on. Wheat Dookie. That's a new name. We got to hurry up and do this before I get kicked out. All right, King of Customs. I remember him. He's coming in. King of Customs. Who else we got? Let's get some new people in here. Warm Marbron Boss. I don't even know what that one is. Is he down here at the bottom? Oh, wait, I thought I saw him here. Warm something ombus. Uh, wet dash dookie. Let's see. Yeah, let's get him in here. I like a good wet dookie. Okay, he lied about being in here. Wet is not in here. Um, Spoodsy. Spoodsy. There he is. Um, a, a gingy. Come on. See if I can just do gingy. There we go. There we go. Now that's a team right there. You know what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit print. And then, oops, cancel and hit ready. All right. Yeah, we got the squad now. I'm sorry, Shrapnel 10. I'm looking here. I'm looking here. Shrapnel 10, where's he at? Come on. He's around here. Wait, are you telling me? Oh, I'm so sorry. I've been seeing your name and I haven't I haven't gotten you in once. D2 stair guard, lots of crabs, Joe's toes, scavs matter too. The baby nut. Shamrock eleven. Ooh, shrapnel 10. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'll get you in the next one. I could have swore. The reason why I didn't pick you is I was like, oh, I recognize the name. You were playing. You were on last time. That's what it was. I think I invited shrapnel and then he ended up getting kicked or something for, uh, for some reason. All right, hold on here. I'm going to do... Documents. Uh, no, 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 not documents. Settings. What's that thing called? Dude, what the fuck? Escape from Tarkov. Does it not like look inside my computer first? I hate, I hate, I hate Windows 10. I hate it. There we go. All right, I took the screenshot here. I can look at the names and add them to the list. I'll put them on this side while I work on this. Okay, these guys. Uh, I guess you guys probably want to see the list. Was it this button? And then I really need to work on my, uh, on the way I do this here. All right, these guys. Woo! Uh. They're going to be over here. We're going to start off with... This is going to be the customs squad for uh, chemical part two. God, formatting was always my forte. You could tell. Okay, so first squad, we are going to have warm, warm, war, Mr. Hombus. Okay, uh, King of Customs and Spoodsy. 
as well as a underscore a gingy simp i don't know what that is that better not be a slur or something you're making me say repeatedly because i have no idea what that means all right we're good and now i can uh close out of that open this back up oh, i might want to take that off actually there we go Sam, what is happening? <laughs> I don't even know. Oh. Are you guys... Are these fuels? Everybody grab one fuel. Everybody gets a fuel for the boys. Everybody gets one toilet paper. No, not... No, wait. Fuck. Are these... Oh, these are zero out of a hundred. Fuck. No. <laughs> I was hoping they were actually real. Friendly fire. I get this while I can. And then we gotta we gotta rush down into uh oh that was that. Uh, Sabo rounds. Oh BT. Hell yeah. Alright, let's go to customs. Or uh dorms, that's the one. All right, remember guys, if you see anybody not wearing a tank helmet with balaclava. Oh, look, if anybody needs a backpack, there's one right here. Bucket, go, go, go. Let's do it. Guy with the tan backpack, you lead the way. Fuck it, fuck, fuck it, fuck, fuck it, fuck, fuck, fuck it, fuck, fuck it. Go, go, go. Hold your fire. We got a rat here, damn it. Goddamn traitor! It's 220. Is that the three-story dorms or the the two-story one? Oh, it's it's this one. All right, let's do it. Get in there. Nice. Fuck it. Go go go. Goddamn traitor! Where is it? Where is it at? Where is it at? Where is it at? Is it this? No. Is it this? Is it this one? No. I think I've been swindled. I don't think we're in the... We're not in the right building. Unless it's all the way back here. 217, 216. Want to work together? What the hell? Am I in the wrong building? It's second floor of third story. Fuck. All right, we're going next door, guys. Fucking move it. Lead the way. Second story of third. We can go up over here. Okay, second story. Uh, is this it? Oh, hell yeah. All right. All right, everybody. Keep watch. In the hallway. I'll figure this out. Oh, is it up there? I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking. Take letter. Okay. And then there's go, secure go, flash drive. You got it. What, what about this? What about this? There's some rubles. Go, go, go. All right. Is that it? Is that everything for the quest? Am I playing with viewers? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what, that's what we're doing, dude. You got to... um. I'm getting sherpa around, basically, to do my quests. Very, very, so far, not very good. All right, now we got to make it to uh, uh, ZB013. Let's do, wait, crossroads. Let's go crossroads. Let's go all the way we came, probably. It'd be the smart way. Wait, 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 guys, 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 guys. We got it. We should check, we should check Mark Room. We're here, come on. Okay, there's somebody up there. Let's not check Mark Room. Let's uh, let's get out of here. <laughs> okay, no, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. You guys are already running. You guys are running. Let's do it. Let's go up. Come on. There's someone up here. Fuck it. Go, go, go. Yeah. 
Hell yeah. All right, boys, for getting me this stuff, you get whatever's in here. Oh my God, you guys are getting star rounds and stuff. A star round, yeah, grab it. That's the good shit. A shotgun. Anything else? That's it. Oh, fuck. I knew that was coming because I saw the guy had a KSM on his back. <laughs> fuck. I'll be back in a second. Hold on. I can't see a darn thing. All right, let's go. Oh, was that at one of us? Fucking move it. I got a bad feeling about this. Crossroads. Fuck it. Go, go, go. Man, dude. I. Uh oh. Why are my ears going? Randomly. <laughs> Did my, my guy just have a fucking aneurysm? What was that? What was that? Fuck it. Go, go, Why go. did I just... Did you guys see that? My guy's ears just went all fucking wacky. My sight went all weird. I didn't get hit with a flash or anything. Alright. I think... Uh, hey, I should. we should be able to leave here. Right? Is this an exit? Oh, this is an exit. All right, guys. You guys are getting the highest. Uh oh. I heard someone throw a grenade. Please stop. Okay. <laughs> someone died. <laughs> someone just died. I heard that shit. <laughs> Damn. Yeah, it's a run through, but you know what? We got the fucking quest. That's all that matters. All right. <clears throat> Let's see. Uh I really need to, to set this up properly, but this is, is, uh, you guys, you know what? All across the board, you're getting, uh, I'm just going to do a whole new, a whole new thing. Success. Whole squad. Help me secure the goodies. Mission complete. Two out of ten. That's the highest rating so far. You guys are you guys are really uh, outperforming everybody else that we've had so far. I think that squad. That one's yeah. That one's the best so far today. I'm pretty. Pretty impressed with you guys. Um, I didn't even have to fire a shot in anger or anything. I probably should have stayed and tried to... If I didn't have to get out of there with that stuff, I would have stayed and tried to kill stuff. But uh, Turn this in. Look at that. We're completing stuff now, baby. Uh-oh. My game just died. What happened? Finished. Oh, here we go. Now I got I got new quests here. Hold on. Chemical part three. Uh. Find a syringe with chemicals in the factory. An envelope from the dorm contains some chemical formula and a reaction process described on the flash drive. We found a guy here who's good with the subject. So he said he cooked up something and uh, uh, experimenting with some blue liquid shit, adding a blah, 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 blah. This goes on for a long. Anyway, anyways, go to the, it's a, it looks like a morphine syringe. 
It's bright yellow, looks like a pin, like a morphine syringe. Um, oh wait, I think I know where this is. Chemical part three. Isn't this upstairs near the office? This is upstairs, right? It's, it's a kick in door. Okay. All right, everybody. Get, let's get geared up for factory. I want to see tank helmets. I want to see balaclavas. I want to be able to assess who you guys are from sight. So make sure to do the tank helmet and, uh, bring in your best spray and pray gun for, for factory. I'm putting away the AK and I'm bringing out the PPSH. Oh, I don't have ammo for this. Um, I think it's the white stuff, right? Yeah. We'll do two, 300 rounds of this. There we go. Oh my God. All right, I'm ready. You guys ready? I'm ready. Let's go in. Factory. 15 o'clock. Let's do it. Coomstums. Oh, Admiral Heft. Uh... What, what do we got here? Oh man, there's a whole new... Okay, Spoodsy. I see he's been talking in here for a while. Where's Spoodsy at? Spoodsy! There he is. Oh, that's what we got here. Jo okay, Jordan 6. I'm getting some new names in here. You guys are, are actually popping off. Jordan 6, 9, 4, 20. Who else we got here? Oh, big fucking rat. I, I invited him. He's not coming in. Okay. Oh, look at him. He's got the dude. He's got the, the Saiga with the drum mag. I'm going to write these down really quick. This one's easy. All right, this one's going to be factory chemical part three. We got in the roster, Spoodsy, Admiral Heft. Oh, no, Admirable underscore Heft. Jordan, 69420. And of course, Big Fucking Rat. Boom. Let's do it. Okay, by the way, guys, I didn't want to I didn't want to gloat or anything, but and I still haven't found a complete use for it. But I got a, a slide whistle. This is the nicest one Amazon has. $33, kind of a big deal. So if you guys know of any uses for these other than just uh pissing your friends off once in a while, <laughs> Let me know, please, because I am, I am desperately trying to rationalize buying this. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? That tweet wasn't a lie. Oh, dude, I uh, I tweeted that I was I was gonna be streaming on the secret account, and you should have seen them scrambling. They were trying to figure out what exactly is the secret account. Where is it? And I got on today and checked out the analytics for this uh, stream thing, and I got like. I got like six or seven new follows last night. People were able to figure out where it was. <laughs> I guess they found it on the uh, on the subreddit or something like that. But they, yeah, yeah, comedic prompting. I'll be the next fucking carrot top with this thing. I'll bring in the crowds with my <laughs> with my fucking slide whistle. Wait, 
it on. Wait, can't you do like the and that with this? Wait. No, that's not with it. That's just a whistle, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Twitch actually recommended it to you. Oh, that's not good. Wait, this was recommended. Oh shit, we're in. Mm -hmm. No, this is supposed to be laying in the cut. Yeah, we're not supposed to be recommended. Oh, you're good. All right. Full auto, baby. Goddamn traitor. Goddamn traitor. Even if we have all five people, isn't there one other person that's in here? He better not be a total ass kicker. Let me in. Is it in here? Oh, no, you fucking didn't. It's not there. It's in here, dude. Just stay focused, guys. Isn't it? Isn't this where it is? Does anybody see any drugs? We're looking for drugs. Who threw that? It's this guy. Oh, no, Who is this guy? He's got the PM pistol. Which one was he? PM pistol guy is getting a very negative review at the end of this. Now that's more like it. I got a bad feeling. They say it's in the kick-in room. Kick-in room. Do you guys see any drugs in the kick-in room? Any drugs at all in the kick-in room? Standing on the fucking... Who keeps doing that? It's PM guy. Where's PM guy at? I'm closing this for now until I find it. He said on top of the cabinet or something? I can't believe it. In the cabinet? Left up here. Wait. Got it. Chemical part three. It was in the cabinet. Yeah, he was right. Uh oh. I hear scabs. Okay. We got a fucking rat. Sellers. Gate three, zero. All right, let's go. I'm going to go into the office. Hope there's nobody in here. We're good. Might as well loot a little bit while we're in here. You know, why not? Why not? Give this place a once over. You need to be worried about bear. Do the, uh, I can't see a fucking thing now. Okay. Does anybody, does anybody remember who was the guy with the PM? I want his name. Not bad. Uh Oh, oh no. I just dumped my mag. I dumped my mag. Where is it? That was the, the big was boy. Is it on the ground somewhere? Did I, is it, did I seriously just chuck that thing like on the floor somewhere? Is it just gone for good? How stupid am I? I don't see it. It's not there for me. Those are screws. I don't want screws. I want my fucking. I want my. Son of a. I want my goddamn magazine. Huh? If anybody sees my mag, can you pick it up and then rechuck it on the ground, maybe? No. I think I just ate it. Same the pre cum on the ground. Bastard. I don't see it, dude. Oh. oh, I see it now. Okay, we're good. That thing's a lot smaller on the ground than it looks like on the on the fucking gun. <laughs> okay, I'm ready to go now. Let's do it. Uh oh, I don't want to get shot. I don't want to be the one in the fucking front. Okay, 
okay so if you bring in five is it really full all safe because i've had i swear to god dude i've had people spawn in with me on a five man i mean i know it can be empty but is it always empty wait is it is in there an exit over here in this next exit? it is isn't it yeah he's doing the key to it sweet I got that guy right in the fight. Dude, okay. The tank helmet is better than I thought because I fucking shot that guy square in the head. I saw the bullets hit him in the head. <laughs> the, the, the padding of it. The padding saved me. <laughs> yeah, but, or saved him, yeah. What the hell? Uh, okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and... Uh, no, I did not miss, dude. His fucking... His head cracked back. I saw that. I at least hit him once. All right, check this, check this. It's these guys. Now, they did help me here. I'm not going to lie, but one of them was the asshole throwing flashes the entire time. But uh, that was a pretty, you know what? They, they secured it. They helped me with the thing. I'll admit it was good. Uh, secured the dub. Finished the mission because yeah, you know, they'll get a two out of 10, but I did not appreciate the flashing. The eye flashing was very annoying, but I guess if there was no danger, I mean, it wasn't really that annoying. Was it? I mean, could it have been? I don't think so. All right. Oh, no, it didn't register that I shot anything because I still have 71 out of 71 bullets in here. So that was just a flub. All right, who was that for? Was that Skier? Sweet. Completing tasks like a motherfucker. Chemical part four. And... Can't wait, get first chemical container, hand over first. Okay, wait, where are these at? Hold on. I think go to character and then do tasks. It's a whole lot easier to look at here. Find a transport with chemicals. Big customer. Mark the chemical transport with a beacon. I can do beacons. I can do beacons all day. I like beacons and that's customs. That's right up my alley. Hold on. Uh, what do we got here? Um, find the transport with chemicals. Mark the chemical with a beacon. Do you guys remember what this is? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I get a med case for this? That's pretty cool. Wait, wait, wait. Serious? Wait, oh, is this? Hold on. One of these guys is talking to the other guy. Do it for skier so you don't have to give him one mil. Wait, who's the, who's the, shit. Okay, once I get it, I can then turn around and give it to whoever, right? <laughs> yeah, okay, so, yeah, fuck it. Let's just do it first, and then once we do it, I can, I can figure out who I want to turn it into. How many do I need? How many, uh, How many of these stupid things do I need to, I just need to bring, give it a skier so he can commit war crimes. <laughs> All right. Uh, just one marker. All right. And that's these things, right? The, these little tracker things. Yeah. Yeah. I think one marker. All right. And we're going custom. So I don't think the PPSH is probably the best thing for this. I'm getting the AK back out. 
And I'm bringing back up BT rounds. I'm ready. Let's do it. Customs. You know what? I'm just going to say it. This might rub some people the wrong way. But, oh wait, never mind. I'm not going to do that. I was going to invite the same people from factory, but then uh, you know, if everything had gone perfectly fine, then I would have, but there was some, there was some flashing happening, which I don't want to happen on customs at all. All right. Custom Schlurper. Uh, some guy says that's his name. Customs Schlurper. Oh yeah, I, I remember him from the first stream. All right, custom slurpers coming in. Dude, he's looking juiced. That guy's coming to do business. Rat Adam. What's this guy's name? Rat. Adam? No. I don't see a rat Adam. Sketchy Kid. That's a new name. Hold on. Sketchy Kid. Level four. Do you have a tank helmet, dude? Because th that's the fucking rules. I don't make the rules, man. The rules make the team. So I invited you. If you come in here without a tank helmet, I'm going to start swinging. Let's see. Hey, he hasn't come in here yet. Oh my God. This is pathetic. This is, I can't have this in here. I'm sorry, dude. Did you, this guy's not wearing the uniform. He's not wearing the uniform. This guy's not, it's not close enough. This is not close enough. I know he's only level four, but that's not the uniform. You need Coomstums for Coomstums Slurper to win. Okay. I for, I'm sorry, sketchy kid. You're just you, you ain't got the you, you ain't got the look. When you get the tank helmet and the balaclava and the shades, then you can come. I know I think Coomstums and Coomstums Slurper are friends. If I remember correctly, so I do feel bad about having one and not the other. Aren't you guys friends? Tiny Weed. Okay, let's do Tiny Weed. That's kind of a funny name. Oh, he's level 50. Holy shit. 47, close enough. Who else we got? Wet, wet Dookie. Wet Dookie. What? Wet Dookie declined. You don't decline me. All right, and uh, I'm, I still need one more. Big, big fucking rat, level thirty six. He was in some before. Let's see. What? Wait. What did big fucking rat do last time? Big fucking rat. Where was he at? Oh, he was in factory. That's fine. We'll bring him. Fuck it. Yeah, he, he was in. He was in there. All right, I finished drinking my coke. Uh, yeah, that was barely a run. It was. God, that tank helmet, stanky, dude. That's a, that's a look right there. Bizzle was right the whole time. This is a, it's so forward thinking because nobody. He's, he is the person that gets team killed the least because you see him walking around with that court appointed helmet. Like he has a uh, Asperger's or something. It's an incredible look. You did me dirty there, Sam. You're going to hell for sure. Now I, I, I I'm assuming you're talking about, cause I sent you an invite and then you declined it. So I invited somebody else. I'm sorry, man. Sam, you need to put a flash hider on that AK. You know, uh, I got two flashlights on the AK. That's that's good enough. I don't need anything else. Sam only likes the free market when he can make a living. Otherwise, he's a fucking Stalinist. Uh, I'm more of a Leninist myself, but yes. <laughs> now, I... Uh, I, I do like, I do like the free market. That's for sure. You know, it's actually the most annoying thing in the world. 
it's one of those things where I understand the need for it. But have you guys ever tried to get licensed for something? You know? Like, uh, secretly, deep down in me, if we didn't have such a huge population, I would totally be like a libertarian. Where I'd be like, dude, let's just, like, why do I even need to be licensed for this? Like, getting any sort of certification is so fucking annoying, having to fill out all that paperwork and pay dues and pay for licensing and pay for this and that. But at the same time, I realize that there's, like, con men out there that'll just show up and be like, oh, I'm totally licensed uh, electrician, just let me do it. <laughs> and then your house burns down. I understand the need for it, but it's such a pain in the ass to go through all that red tape to, like, get anything done, to get a business going, to get fucking anything i hate having to deal with state level uh paperwork federal level paperwork it's all a pain in the ass that's why i do what i do right now just because this this job has the least amount of paperwork of any job ever the least amount of uh oversight nobody nobody tells me what to do as long as i'm not filming dead bodies in the japanese suicide forest i basically no flack is thrown my way it's uh it's as laid back as it gets Hmm. All right, where are we going? Do you guys know where we're supposed to mark this thing? You fix it to cooperate? I'm sick and tired of all this running Hi. around. Oh, wait, hold on. I remember some streamers were talking about Sam and one genuinely thought you were a communist. Oh, no, I know that was clean. Yeah, because uh, he was asking me to play... What was he asking me to play? He was asking me to play uh, that game that's like D&D, &D, but I forget what it's called. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. oh, fuck. There was, yeah, there was a guy over there. I couldn't see him. He was, I guess he was, he was over there in the woods. Fuck. <laughs> I didn't even write down the... It was just a scav, too. That's the worst part. I got head eyes by a fucking scav. Baldur's Gate, that's the one. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna re throw together a kit and then uh, get back in there. But um, that was a fast run, dude. That fucking sucked. Okay, so the, the clean thought I was a communist because this is pretty funny. He asked me to play the new Baldur's Gate. Is it Baldur's Gate? I think it's Baldur's Gate. They just came out with it. It was like. No, no, uh, not Baldur's Gate. It's uh, it's something else. There's some stupid game where like you make a character and then you and your friends go, Pfft. yeah, whatever. He wanted to play it with me, and he was like, "Hey, dude, will you will you play it with me?" And I said, uh, "You know what? I didn't want to play it. Really, is what it was, and I didn't have the time to play it at the time. And so I I told him, "Sorry, dude. Like as a communist, I can't play or be seen playing with someone that." that touts their second amendment rights so flagrantly and he saw it and like fuck it he he totally thought i was being serious <laughs> he was like oh okay i guess and then he fucking never talked to me again and uh and then he left that like i thought i was obvious that i was joking because he's like a gun guy he's got like all these fucking guns and everything behind him he's got the the neo rack from the matrix of guns or no way that's landmark now clean just has he just has a bunch of guns and um and he walked away from that thinking that I was actually like a communist which I thought was kind of funny <laughs> all right I think I'm gonna go with uh I did I'm gonna do the tactical glasses this time instead of the dundurks dunducks ooh that's not a good look look at these things they're like clear not like the dunducks are <laughs> yeah but anyways guys like uh if you guys own firearms you know you're really just not you're not that cool in my eyes because real homies are really into um authoritarian governments <laughs> the only people that should have guns are the federal um police state police those are the only people that should have guns um, 
I think a uh, population should fear the police like the Dickens <laughs> and not be able to fight back in any way. Yeah. Uh, prove, wait, what? Hold on. Prove your ideology by telling us who you voted for. Oh, I'm a, I'm a Biden man through and through. I think this country is going to be saved by an octogenarian. <laughs> yeah. Now, I, uh, you know what's funny is this guy says that uh, guns are overrated. I keep my katana at my side. I'm, I'm getting rid of, uh, as you guys know, I just got a, a, a new baby, right? I just fresh off the presses. And my other daughter is like two and a half, three now. And she's starting to get into things, you know, like I fucking turn my back for two seconds and she is just doing something. And so I'm kind of, I have all these guns and I'm like, I don't know if I should keep these fucking things with her around. And even if they're like locked up safely, I, well, I don't want to go get, I want, I want you guys right now that aren't playing to go look up just gun safe. Just Google gun safe. And take a look at those fucking things. And tell me with a straight face you would want one of those in your house. Every gun safe that has ever been manufactured, they're all hideous. Absolutely hideous. And I was like, I don't want to... <laughs> if my options are having gun or... In like locking it up in one of those fucking things or not having guns, I would rather just not have guns. <laughs> They're fucking, they are so ugly. And this guy's like, just toss it under your bed. No, you can't. Oh, get a trigger lock and toss it under your bed. Okay. Well, I could get a trigger and breach lock, but then I just have loose guns lying around. I just don't like the look of it, you know? So, hold on. My fucking thing turned off. And this turned off too. There we go. So, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get an in wall safe where it doesn't have the face of a, of a safe and I sink it. I have to cut out the drywall and like sink it between the studs and everything. And then it'll be flush with the wall and I'll be able to just have some like shotgun or something like that. But, uh, but I do have a katana and that's my real thing here is that like, do I get rid of like, I'm, I'm sitting here trying to get rid of dangerous weapons that my daughter can hurt herself with and I'm getting rid of all these guns, but then I still have the katana, you know? I don't want to get rid of it, but it is really a weapon of mass destruction. Like there's, if there's one weapon in my house that could slay an entire village, it would be that one. So that's definitely going into the, into the wall safe. Or should it be, a, should it be displayed? Possibly like, uh, in the gable of my, of my roof so that my neighbors know the kind of man that lives here, you know? Get rid of the guns, keep the katana. That's what I'm thinking, yeah. Uh, Sensei, Sensei Pantheon. There we go. There's a new one. He's not even on. He lied to me. What? Hold on. Pantheon. Did he spell his own name wrong? No, he didn't. Um, Jar Jar Binks. Okay, that guy's not on either. You guys have to look for group, right? You guys know that, right? Shamrock 11. Wait, hold on. Shamrock, that, that sounds familiar. Oh, he took a bullet for me on Woods. Died heroically. He's coming back. Okay, I'm going to look for Pantheon again. Yeah, he's not on. Customs, 15 o'clock. Shamrock led me into a minefield. Sensei Pantheon. I'm going to look again. I'm going to look again. I'm going to give him... There he is. I'm going to give him the opportunity. I'm going to look up Jar Jar Binks again. There he is. You guys are fucking big ass levels. What the hell? 46? Bullet to the knee. Oh my god. If, uh, if Bullet to the Knee gets in here, then that's everybody. I'm really digging Jar Jar Binks. He's got... Oh, look at, oh, look at that guy. He's got, <laughs> he's, 
got the tank helmet and the gas mask. That might be the unofficial look. I think I'm going to go with that next time. That's a look. Gas mask with the tank helmet. Holy shit. Let's do it. Yeah, that's that's extra poggers. All right, what's this mission I'm doing again? Um, it's the, the one for all three. Is it chemical part four? Chemical part four. Who to turn into? Okay, no, no. I just want to see what I'm marking here. Chemical part four. Uh, I need to go into the thing and do the thing. I got the marker. Warehouse marked on the map. Oh, it's the one that sniper scavs on top of. And the vehicles were... Okay, and then I place it on the vehicle inside, right? Yeah, okay. Hey, we were right next to it, too. Sam, you seem like a huge basketball fan. I can just smell it. I love basketball. I spend possibly most of my uh, time not playing video games, watching basketball. Um, that's, I've never watched a game of basketball once. I've never, <laughs> I've never even attempted to watch it. I've just, I've, whenever I see it on, all I hear is the squeaking of their shoes. And I'm like, what? The? Oh, yeah, I guess I could. I guess during the loading screens, I could just talk to you guys with my camera. Um, I don't I don't think I've, I don't think I have any interest in watching basketball. Actually, hold on. I I don't have any interest in um, it's it's not that I don't have an interest in basketball. I don't have an interest in watching sports. You know, I, the same thing. Like I won't watch. I, I won't watch like a league tournament. I won't watch like a counter strike tournament. I'm not going to watch a football game. I'm not going to like, why watch it when you can just go, I would much rather just play a game of like touch football than, than fucking like watch the super bowl or something like that. I just, I don't get it. Um, it's just not my thing to like watch that stuff. Yeah. The light makes you look so greasy. It's probably cause I'm fucking greasy, dude. Yeah, it's because I'm greasy. I could turn off the light if it's if it's making you uncomfortable. I can I can sit in the dark here, which is much more comfortable for me because then I don't have the lights coming down on me. Yeah. Yeah, dude. If you guys don't mind, I can I can sit in the dark, baby. I don't care about sitting in the dark. Get really low in the dark. Hi. Hey, hold on. How you doing? It's just you and me in the dark, baby. Got a problem with that? <laughs> All right. So we got bear. And now okay. We, got we are absolutely cats. nowhere near the thing, I don't think. Come on. <laughs> So that's what the tape is for. Dude, I found on a on like Wish or some shit. Or Banggood, I think, is is the other one. It's like some Thai, Taiwanese market website or something like that. I found where I can buy the cheapest, smallest USB webcam. And that's what I'm going to use to take the place of the C920 over here. Because this thing's kind of big on the mic. I just want to have like this tiny little, tiny little thing on there. I refuse to be the first to die. I refuse. Take him out, guys. Get in there. I'll make a run for it. <sighs> no, the C920 is the fucking Logitech webcam, dickass, not the mic. I have the C920 like taped to the mic. Get him! Damn Ivans. You guys kill him? Oh, good job. Nice. Hey you! Fuck you! Die, scav! All right. I say, you know, I'm not the leader of this thing, but I am the only person that can talk, and everybody here. So, uh, <laughs> so that does kind of make me the unofficial uh, uh, leader here. Let's. Oh, we're gonna go through. Okay. You know what? If 
you guys are just gonna lead the way through construction, let's just go through construction. Fuck it. Why not? What's going on over there? I think everybody has a higher strength than me. I'm I can barely keep up stamina wise. Go ahead. Make sure we do a clean sweep. The G920 is a nice wheel for Forza. I was that dude, I bought the uh it's like the one downgrade from the Logitech one. Or no, I got a different wheel than the Logitech one because it was like sold out when uh when the quarantine started. But I got a different wheel for that GTA video and for some uh, a set of cores of stuff we were going to do. And, uh-oh. Whereas Brian got the, I think he got the Logitech G920. And he will not let me live it down that he has a fucking clutch and a stick shift with his that I don't have. Like, mine's automatic. His has the clutch and everything. And he's just like, oh, so you got the fucking pussy version. The fucking pussy version, huh? You can't even shift gears, eh? I'm like, dude, fucking call you've used the thing like twice. You act like you're spending all day driving with a fucking the Logitech. Hmm. Wonder what's None of us here. use it often enough to fucking brag about it. You know what I should do? I should get like the ten thousand dollar like F one racing uh replacement one. And then just uh, shit on them the whole time about uh, the quality of my wheel that I never use. All right, let's get in here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Please don't shoot me. Hey, we're getting close, man. This Got it. Smooth, like Smooth like ass. Dude, you guys, you guys are being pretty good to me today. This is working out fine. It's this vehicle, right? Plant, there we go. Boop. Nice. Hey, don't take it off. Don't touch it. Did he take it off? Oh, okay. I thought it disappeared. Oh, I just fractured my hand. Okay. Got him cold. I was because it disappeared like once I backed up a little bit. I was about to start gunning. Dude, put that on. Put on the gas mask. Found something. Yeah. There you go. That's the look. Go, go, go! What a look. All right, we we did it. That's it. The hell was that? Let's go check the streamer room for the uh for the, the graphics card and then let's get out of here. Hmm. Wait, 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 wait. Check the back of the van for fuel. I'm going back. The guy said there might be six hundred thousand dollars worth of fuel back here. I'm going back for the van. I'm separated from my crew. It's a risk I'm willing to take. I thought I was, I thought I had just pogged out with fuel. I was really happy there for a second. Okay, there's none here. All right, I'm coming back. <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, now the real question is, do you guys want to go uh, third party, those people fighting, or do you want to just get out of here? I'm, go uh, I'm going up into the streamer room, I think. The streamer building. That's up here. There we go. 
Nope, no graphics card. Damn it, Daniel. Oh, my hand's broken. You better worry about there. How did you survive this long without making barely any money from YouTube? I think YouTubers really, uh, they, they fucking complain a lot about the lack of money because it's like, it's some huge faux pas to like be making money off of YouTube. Like people hate your guts. If you're like, yeah, I actually, I live very comfortably off YouTube and, uh, they're your, your favorite YouTuber. He'll complain about it, but he's doing fine. He's doing fine. Even during the height of like the adpocalypse, you know, in like 2016 or whenever the fuck that happened, it, it dropped down like 50%. So everybody's income got cut off like 50%, but all those YouTubers that had fucking Lambos and shit, they could still, they were still living fine. They were still living fine. Cause they were making hundreds of thousands or some shit. And then they were just, Oh, boo hoo. Now they're only making a hundred thousand dollars a year. I can't live off of this. I'm going to have to sell my second mortgage. Fuck off. They're doing fine. If, if anybody's no making over my ass. even like a couple okay. million views a month, even like 2 million, 3 Best. million views a month, they're doing fine money wise. Oh, I just fractured my hand. Sniper calling it. Yeah, yeah, they, they act like it's like really cool to say you're suffering. Yeah, I, I guess that's what it is. Uh, maybe like victim complex. Maybe it has something to do with like, if you act like you don't have any money, they're more likely to subscribe or some shit. I don't know. But, um, I'm doing fine. I'm doing all right. Not my Patreon is for my, uh, my second channel and that doesn't have any ads on it. So the Patreon's like, you know, uh, supplementing what income I would have from that channel, but it's, it's doing great. There's a, where the fuck are we going? First of all, hold on. Let me stand out here in the open and try to figure this out. Oh, we could just leave. Yeah, what the heck? AK here. Can I take that? Oh, oh my God. I got a key. What? Grab it, dude. I ain't taking that. Someone grab it. I'm not that that's beyond my pay grade. Yes, All right, let's get out of here. CB 012. It's this way, right? You want to go? Do you guys want to keep going? You want to keep checking? This one's been. Hold on. Let me check the. Let me check the quest. Let me really check the quest here. I can't believe. Command What's the name of this thing? Left us here. Survive and exit customs location. I do have to survive and exit apparently. All right, everybody, line up. If you want to continue, you do an up and down. If you want to exit, you do a left and right. What do you want to do? All right, they want to carry on. They, they want. They, they're they're hungry for blood. They want more. <laughs> God, he, killing one man was not enough. Let's go. Let's go check out to see if Rashal is here at, at uh, the gas station, and then we'll go to dorms. Asshole. Damn, I'm tired of this walking. Does that sound good? Is that a good compromise? We'll get our. Uh, yeah, they're thirsty, man. They want some, they want some dicking. Remember, do not shoot a man with a tank helmet. It's unethical. That's scav on scav violence. Hmm. Yeah, um... Oh, hey, the little trooper armor thing. That'd be cool if I wasn't, you know, dedicated to the tank helmet only. Anybody here? Uh, I'm in the middle of, like, playing right now, so I can't exactly read this guy's message verbatim. But what he was saying is... Where'd you guys go? Did you guys leave me? Are you up front? Please, God, say you're up front. Okay. There they are. There's my boys. My boys! All right, let's go to, let's go to dorms. Um, this guy said to the effect of like, the problem is Sam, if you're making a certain amount of money and then all of a sudden it's cut in half, people have uh, their lifestyle that they, you know, have, have come to expect 
and all of a sudden it's cut in half. All right. You know, I agree with that. I understand that. But I think uh, YouTubers specifically. Hold on. There's kind of a fight here. Should I shoot just so I feel like I'm part of the group? There, I shot once. I'm one of us. Yeah, one of us. Okay. Anyways, now now that we're now that we're done with that. <laughs> Let's clear out these fucking places. We're looking for Rashala. Mr. Shala, are you here? Oh, my hand's broken. Here, I'll, I'll go hide in here for now. Oh, wait, that's not a good hiding spot. I'll hide in here for now. Okay, so the problem with that is, like, if you're a YouTuber, you should recognize the fact that your your income is going to fluctuate left and right, up and down, dude. You're going to be all over the place. And I think what a normal person would do, at least what I've done, is you look at your lowest month in a given year or two years, and you just base your, your budgeting off of that. Everything else is any any plus is gravy, you know. But what what's that called? Uh, um, I forget what that's called. Where like you're spending a, a lifestyle creep. That's what it's called. So if like you have your life set to a certain budget, and then all of a sudden you're making more, like regardless of whether you want to or not, like you're gonna start spending a little bit more. You know, you're gonna start eating up a little bit of that extra paycheck and all of a sudden that raise you got doesn't feel like that much of a raise because you still have the oh, same God. nothing God. money left God. over at the end lifestyle creeps a real thing but I think uh, you know name one industry out there. there there's plenty of people that have jobs every day that you know tomorrow they might get laid off they're making good money now but tomorrow they might get laid off and YouTube's just the same shit you know Make money while you can, I guess. The only difference is that YouTubers have a huge platform to fucking cry and bitch and moan about it and fucking like, oh, please, please. Oh, God. My ads. My, my ads. My dedicated mid-video ads. <laughs> they won't put ads on it anymore. Yeah, the bitrate's stuck at like 2,500. It's pretty low. Oh shit, what do we got? Big roll, you got a dox case? Hey, I see a leg. You got a dox case and a shotgun. Nice. No, no, no. I don't want it. Over here. Grab it. It ain't mine, dude. You guys are bringing me for my chemical part four. All right. You guys get to keep the good shit. Uh, except for this AK 74 I found. The hell is that? That's oh, a mask. Whoa, 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 whoa! You guys are throwing out a perfectly good pair of dun Dundix, which I'm gonna replace with my glasses because I don't like the T glasses. Suck. All right, now let's do another poll here, guys. Up and downs if you want to continue and fight. Left and rights if you want to exit and be safe. I'm seeing two up and downs. Three up and downs, four up and downs. They want to continue on. What's up, baby? Just stay focused, guys. Okay. Bro, what do we got that here? sounds good. Yeah, just leave the door open. That's fine. Apparently, there's a massive storm happening. And so, my wife's going to go get my kid from daycare. And I am in charge of watching my baby. So, if there's some crying halfway through this, you know, you guys are just going to have to deal with it. Yeah, babysitter stream. It's fine, dude. Kids are awesome. Everybody likes kids. What do we have here? That's a lie. Not not everybody likes kids, but you guys are gonna have to deal with mine. Okay. All right, guys. Let's let's make this one count because we probably got one more left. <laughs> let's go clear out Crackhead House and uh, the skeleton area. Oh, wait, we clearing second floor? Huh. 
this guy. Well, I'm Taz. Damn, son. Nothing. Garbage. Oh, I think I, I have a feeling these guys just don't want to leave because they don't want to have to uh, not be playing in here anymore. All right, a uh, guy with. Guy Happy with, uh, beds. let's see, what does this guy have? Oh, my arm's fucked. Taz guy, gas so mask guy, you lead the way. We're going to the new part of construction. New construction. We're going to clear it out, because that's the other place where Rashala can go. Even though, you know he's dead by now if he's still here. Wait, 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 is that a body? No, it's not, okay. And I don't know about you guys, but I could really use a fucking snack. Not in game, but like IRL. Kind of hungry. Ooh. Uh oh, someone's moving over there. Someone's awake. Hey, down for a party? Is there a massive storm coming? Hey, can someone do a big fucking Doppler radar check on Tallahassee, Florida? <laughs> Give me a uh, suss out the situation. Give me a... Uh, Give me a looks good or looks like you might die tonight. I'll hit him eventually, dude. It's all about eventually. Oh my God, he's taking bullets. Guy with the gas mask is taking bullets. He was killed. That was just a scav, right? Yeah. Oh, he had the mask. Oh, there's a tornado watch. That's not good. Okay. By the way, some of our friends have already gone over there. So like, don't start gunning us down. We're coming from the the right. Yeah, he sees us. All right, we're good. We're good. God, why is my guy always out of stamina? This is pathetic. All right, I'll be upstairs. Me and some other guy are upstairs. Please don't gun us down. Put in that scene from that, uh, what's that Iraq war movie in Kuwait where Samuel Jackson tells them to open fire on the civilians. Cause I think that's, <laughs> that's basically yeah, what that looked like. Right, I'm going to see if ZB 013 is open. Cause we've checked everywhere where, where Shala can be. And you guys are just insane. You just want to keep going for nothing. This place is empty. Lights not on. No way has fucking power on. God damn it. All right, people, we're jumping the fence, getting the fuck out of here. We got to run over to a uh, uh, old gas station, jump the fence. Please don't shoot me in the back if you see me. I'll wait over here at the railroad. You guys coming? Guys? Guys? Am I alone? Did they all die from a sickness? Oh, that's okay. That's one of us. I see the tank helmet. 
All right, looks like it's just me and you, dude. I don't know where everybody else went. Wait, they're fighting. Those are grenades. Hey, down for a party? Grenades. Is that is that down at Crack House? <laughs> These guys. Yeah, I, I think I think I think there's something happening down here. And nobody told me. Who's that guy? Is that guy have a helmet? He's got a tank helmet. Over here. Get dug in. Three. In the movie. That's Wait. Yeah, that's four. Who's the guy on the right that we just saw running? You fix it to cooperate? He was one of us, right? Let's do this. I pray to God he was. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go turn on the power. Yeah, they just they just want to run through. Oh, there he is. That's the guy we saw. Hey, what's up, dude? He's our Russian interpreter. Everybody else, I think, is USAC except for that guy. All right, I'll show you guys how it's done. Instead of okay, you guys can go on through. I'm gonna jump through like a man and avoid all conflict. spooky hmm. this can't be the real sam he says surely it is maybe is this really sam yeah it is it's me it's me wait what this guy say i died to a camper in gas stay away uh-oh Okay, I'll turn on the power and then I still have to go buy gas in order to get out of here, don't I? Isn't that the only way? Friendos? Are they all dead? I hear someone running. Oh, oh my God. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> all right. I think they got them all. I think they got them. Hey, did you guys get them? What the fuck am I Yeah, doing? check this out. You can make this rad jump if make you're. Make sure we do a clean sweep. Ready? Yeah. Oh, fuck. You can make it up and over and then not have to go through all this crap. All right, I'm going through the uh, um, ZB013. Uh, I'll see you guys uh, later. Hmm. Hmm. Getting the fuck out of here. You guys know that that uh, that webum of that that black lady with the long fingernails eating um, uh, pickles really loudly into a microphone. I want her to become a dedicated Tarkov streamer with her long fingernails <laughs> and the same mic, <laughs> just the same mic. You hear every click and clack of your keyboard, everything. That's what I, that's what I want in a streamer with a keyboard cam. Yeah, of course, of course, a keyboard cam. <laughs> that would be excellent. All right, that squad, you know what? I'm going to go ahead. I'm, I'm not going to lie. They were kind of good. Okay, they got me through. They got me the goods. They uh, they wanted to go for the kill. There was no kills to be had. We got marked room. Somebody got a docs case. Somebody also got a key card, labs key card. Um, pretty, pretty good all around raid. Uh, it was pretty good all around. I feel like I'm weird sitting here in the dark. I'm going to wait. No, that's too bright. How about this? What if I do this? I can turn on the other the other lights. If I do like a, it's red. Oh, let's do, 
Is there like a yellow or something I can do? There we go. Yellow light. Just a little bit of backlight there. There we go. That's not so fucking weird. Um, yeah, these guys, these guys were, were just reliable. You know, you could tell they wanted to go for the kill though. I mean, they, they, they dragged me around for 48 fucking minutes through an empty map, but all around good guys. I mean, they were, <laughs> they were pretty solid. They were pretty solid. Uh, so I'm, high marks from me, high marks. I'm definitely gonna give them a two out of 10 on that one. Um, let's see here. Is this, uh, this game even working Hold on? I'm having spinning problems. Hold on, I gotta, I'm gonna do, um, this is the whole part of the testing stream. I'm gonna make sure everything's still working. This is still working, right? Yeah? Hold on, I gotta go check the, uh, I gotta check, make sure the baby's still alive. Oh my god. She's just a napping. She's napping. Oh, she's just napping over there. She's taking a little, a little, a little sleeper. Yeah. Uh, Sam, I don't understand on why you don't work out. Like you don't want to feel healthy and strong. Oh no, I, I do. Um, not, I, not that I do work out. I do want to feel healthy and strong. Uh, and I'm going to do the age old excuse of, I don't have time. That's what I'm going to do. Uh, I could theoretically get up really, really early and uh, go for runs and stuff or work out. But the problem is, is that I have, I do this for a living, right? And then I do the podcast. I spend a lot of time editing, um, and then when I'm not working, which editing and stuff takes a long time, it's really time intensive. And when I'm not doing that, I like to hang out with my family. And like, you know, if I go for a walk or something like that, I want to do it with my wife and my kids. So I can't like go fucking like running with a, with a, with a one month old. <laughs> I mean, that's fucking weird. Uh, but I think, uh, I'll have more time and not more time. I'll have more opportunity to work out when my daughter's a little bit older. But right now, I mean, I sleep for two hours at a time because she wakes up every two hours at night. So, and has to be fed every two hours at night. So like, I ain't doing shit right now more than I have to. Yeah. Who cares about family? It's all about those gains. Also, at the end of the day, like, yeah, I do want to, I, I will admit I felt really good when I lost a bunch of weight, when I got down to like 214 pounds or something like that, I felt great. Um, and so that, that is a huge factor. Like feeling good is, is something I want to do, but at the same time, uh, food tastes so damn good. <laughs> there is not, dude, you, if you make anything with like sugar in it, like a cake or a pastry donut cookies, anything like that, I will, I will do anything to eat that shit. Like I, I have a very bad sweet tooth. I have a pretty, pretty bad sweet tooth. Yeah. No, healthy food can taste great, but I'm not that much of a savory guy. Most healthy food, like if you have like, if you make like a really good healthy meal or whatever, it's like the best you can get is like super savory stuff, but there's no, there's no like healthy sweet stuff. You know what I mean? Start eating Indian food. It's healthy and tasty. All right. That's subjective. Indian food tastes like shit. Fruit is not, dude, no, no, you cannot sit there with a straight fucking face. You dipshit. You can't sit there and say, oh, you know, well, these are the same thing and hold up a fucking cupcake and an apple. That's not the same shit. You can't fucking act like that's the same. Those do not scratch the same itch. <laughs> you fucking psycho. That's not even close. 
<laughs> it's nature's candy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> yeah, it's not even close to the same. But you can sit there and have like, you can have a, a piece of fish and like make it like my wife is a fantastic cook and she, she'll make some like some great health. She'll make like a kale salad thing and like with like cooked greens and like some beautiful piece of, uh, of salmon. And it's, it's a great savory meal, but I'm, I'm like, at the end of it, I'm like, dude, now, all right, now where bust out the eclairs. I know you got them somewhere. Come on. <laughs> I know you got them. Hey, what's up, Toothy? Uh, anyways, yeah. Dude, don't fucking talk shit about fish. Okay. Fish fish is fine. Toothy, are you a... You got the check mark. Are you a fucking... Are you partnered? You looking like you're partnered. Toothy, are you partnered? Just got it a few days ago. He's a partnered streamer. <sighs> Congratulations, Toothy, on the partnership. Congratulations. You're such a big boy. I remember I remember when Toothy was yay high. He was, he was about eight inches tall. And his voice, his voice was so high pitched, and he was he was like ah! And we would play Rust. I would see him on Rust, and he was so high pitched. Um, and he was basically used for the gimmick of like, check out this seven year old child I have in my pocket. And then I didn't talk to him for years. And when I talked to him again, his his testicles had descended down, and now he has a very uh, deep voice, a threatening voice. He's got Javier Bardem's voice from No Country for Old Men and he told me to uh he told me to call it. <laughs> yeah. He's like <laughs> he flips a coin and he tells me to call it. That's that's his voice now. And he's really good at this game. <laughs> so anyways, if you want to uh, but he still kind of I think has Asperger's. I just want I just want to clarify I'm not saying he's like cool and grown up and deep voice and normal. He's He's still just as fucking weird as he was before, but he's just a grown up version of that. But anyways, if you want to, uh, he's, he's a partnered guy. I can't talk shit about him now. What am I doing? I'm sorry. Uh, Toothy's a great guy. It's a good, it's against uh, TOS to talk shit about partnered streamers. Um, I've just wanted to say, I've always felt like Toothy is a valued member of this community and he's a great guy. Great streamer and Aqua FPS. Same thing. Couldn't say enough good things about the guy. He's a great dude. Great content creator. I'm not at all bound by legal paperwork to state this. I think he's just a great guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Anyways, uh, let's. I think we can do one more. Yeah. Hmm. Isn't shawarma healthy? I don't know if fucking shawarma is healthy. Bah. Is shawarma healthy? Isn't shawarma where they like, they have like a, a small child on a rotisserie and then they like slowly cut some of them off or something? Isn't that how that works? Hold on. Uh, my, my, my mom's back. I might have to ask her if I can keep streaming for a little bit. Hold on. Before we even start this, all right, preemptively, just in case mom says yes, preemptively get ready for a, uh, wait, who should I turn this into? Hold on, let me check these out. Skier? Everybody says skier. Uh, Toothy, you're the guy, okay, Toothy says skier too. All right, I'll turn it in. If you guys are wrong here, I'm going to come. Uh, what do we get? Oh, a grenade case. Some rubles. And negative one for Jaeger. I don't fucking care. Jaeger's, Jaeger's a bum that lives out in the woods. I don't give a shit. Okay, remember when I said that the whoever translated this crap doesn't... It, none of it's written like a person would actually speak. Who sounds like this? Ready? 
Now that's right on. Well, we're tied up good, bro. Awesome that you would awesome that you didn't chicken out at the last moment. Now I can fill you in on really serious business. If that fucking 45 year old guy with a toboggan on talked to me like that, I would sucker punch him right in the balls. <laughs> well, now we're tied up good, bro. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's fucking weird. They got some the Russian over usage of bro. Yeah. Okay, well, thanks for the grenade case, guys. That's nice. Uh, vitamins part one. The rigged game. Put a marker on the metal container at health resort. Put a marker at the metal containers that caught it. Didn't I just do this? Did, didn't I just do this? Oh, uh, Isn't a toboggan a head thing too? Like a hat? No, no, no I, I'm saying like I did this last stream. I could have swore I put the markers at the health resort, the cottages, and the pier last stream. Yeah, you do it again. Fuck. Why do I have to do it a second time? It's already marked for what's her face. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna look up. I'm gonna look this up right now. Toboggan hat. Toboggan hat. Oh, you guys are about to eat your own fucking dicks for dinner, dude. I'm looking at it right now. Toboggan hat. Yeah, you, you guys feel fucking stupid. You guys feel real fucking stupid. It's a knitted beanie. Hey, babe. I'm assuming I can... Oh, wait. She's hitting buttons. Uh, can I stream for like 30 more minutes? Yeah. Okay, cool. Mom says I can keep streaming, guys. Yeah, it's a regional name. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <sighs> All right, everybody. Let's go to the health resort. All right, I got one last shoreline one that I can do. Uh, bring in, uh, I got to bring in the three markers. Do I have another one? There we go. Okay. And... I think this is, this is a good setup, right? We're doing it. Let's go. Wait. Wait, 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 I need to eat. I drink some of this delicious water. I got some in here. Mm. 